All right, don't hang up. Don't slam the door on our face. Don't exit out of this video. This is not a solicitation video. This is Craig and Colin from Collins Club. <laughs> um, we're going to take an old pair of headphones that have been around a while, the Sony Silver Wires, and all the discrepancies that were about this headset, except for how incredible they sounded, we are going to show you how to fix, okay? We did a video of an unboxing on these headphones over a year ago, but here's the two issues that were online about these and that I even had. The headphones, for example, coming out of the box, hold it in the middle, all right? See how tight those ear things are? For an adult, they were too tight. You're going to want to get them like this. Look at the difference on how far apart the earmuffs are. And that's because my old school tactics and ways, I'm going to show you how to get your headphones like that without stretching them and breaking them because that's what people were doing. Secondly, the headphone mic microphone. People were going up and down with it because when you click it up, it mutes it. When you put it down, you can... if you keep doing that, you're going to break them like I did and wear the microphone out. Just mute the mic through the chat. All right, well, here we go. Hang tight. It's a little bit lengthy, but I'm going to show you how to spread these headphones apart and they stay that way so they're always going to be comfortable on your head like they are on mine now. Woo! These headphones are tight on people's head. If you've got a big block head like mine, these headphones right here are going to kill your ears, but I have a way to fix that. See how they sit? They're very tight. They're small. On a head like mine, it's going to hurt. But what you do is I'm going to show you how to expand these. I've seen people online go like this and keep stretching them, and then this breaks right here, and then they blame Sony and all that. It ain't that. I'm going to put something to spread them out, and then I'm going to heat this up really carefully, and it's plastic. So if you heat it, it'll go like this. And we're going to try and get it to where instead of sitting like this, they sit a little open because, like I said, these things sound awesome. You are not going to complain if you buy these. They still sell them. They've been around a while. And the cord is perfect length for going into your controller. This is perfect length from coming from your system and right into there. So here we go. And one other thing, the mic. If you don't pull this mic all the way down and click it, it's going to be in mute mode. Once you put it up like this, it's in mute. This is how I broke these headphones out. I kept using this mic in mute mode. Somebody would say something and I'd want to talk to somebody in the house, so I'd push it up and mute it. After a while, this wore out. The connectors inside wore out. The headphones still worked, staticky. It was my fault. I broke them. All right, here you have it, folks. We got a shoe box, the headphones, and a hair dryer. This is what you want to do. I got a shoe box, okay? I got some Puma white sneakers about a month ago. I keep the boxes all the time in case Colin has a project for school. How do I want to do this? Do I want to do it this way? Very simple. Yes, you can. But I'm going to take a chance. And folks, I'm telling you, you got to be careful on this. All right? Take the headphones. Slowly. This is plastic. It will break. All right? I can slowly get them if I hear anything or feel anything like this. Now, one thing I remember, underneath here is padding. See that padding? You don't want to heat that up and melt it. It's going to be tough. You got to go slow, real slow, okay? I'm going to heat this very slowly, but I'm just going to start here and show you what to do, and then I'm going to turn off the video. And then we'll go from there and I'll bring it back on, all right? But I'm going to start out real quick. Just hold this sucker in the center, back and forth, back and forth. Because this is your bend point right here. This right here is like your pinnacle, okay? Right here, you just want to heat it up slowly, get that plastic nice and hot, but you don't want to melt it, all right? We're just heating it up because what I want is I want this thing to stay flexed because I have a blockhead, as you saw in the intro. <laughs> All right, so I am going to, uh, right now, what do we got? It's like 12.14. I'm gonna stop the video and do this for about maybe, I don't know, we'll go three minutes, maybe five minutes. Yeah, who wants to sit here and do something that long? But like I said, these are $19 headphones, and you know what? It's worth it. The headphones are worth the money. The USB extension uh, amplifier cord is well worth that money. All right, so I'll be right back. All right, so I wasn't getting what I wanted on the on low on the hair dryer, so I had to step it up to high. So it's been coming out a lot hotter. We've been doing this for about five minutes, and I'm going to stop here. Okay. All right, there you go. Now don't take them off right after you do this because they're still warm, and the molecules got to cool down. So you can either put a fan on it or let it sit on its own or stick it in your freezer. I mean, take the box, be careful, move the whole thing into your freezer for a few minutes because this has to cool down the way it's stretched. All right, now people, if you pull these things apart all the way like I did on something this wide and break them, don't be messaging me and saying, I broke them all, you, should, you shouldn't have shown me. Have your father help you, your mother help you, your grandmother, your grandfather. Have an adult help you if you're younger and you're not sure. 
but you gotta expand them on the box sideways first and try it that way for your head. But I got a big head, so I just went with the box on the, on the width, because like I said, my head's big. So, and I don't, these headphones are so incredible. After about a half hour of wearing them, I used to have to take them off because it hurt my ears. Well, I want these headphones. They're so good. So let it cool down. You can get a fan. Um, and blow it on there or just walk away for a little while. I put them in the refrigerator. See, maybe the freezer would have been too much. This way they can cool down a little slower. But I can already tell that it was working because as I moved it, these ear pads started to slide down the box easier. If you remember when I expanded it and put it over the box, it was really tight. And now they slid down kind of on their own. So it must be working. But we're gonna let it chill in here next to the milk and then we're gonna give it a shot and give it a try and uh, show you how it looks. All right, folks, here you have it, okay? I'm gonna take them off of here. Now, some people might have said, hey, why didn't you use the uh, PlayStation box? This box, if you can see, is a little bit wider than this Puma box, okay? And I was a little worried about this box because that one inch extra of width, who knows if it could break? But I bet you it'll fit over this box now because I tried to earlier and I was a little worried. Okay, so we're gonna take these off, slide them up nice. Look at, look at that. Do you remember when I bought them? When I bought these things, you remember what they looked like? They were all the way in here, okay? Look at how they are now. Now that is gonna fit my big noggin toboggan. Let me see. I can't even tell you, that's perfect. But listen folks, I'm gonna tell you right now, when you do it, start like this. Start on the side if you're younger and see if that fits good. If that don't fit good, then go like this because look, I'm not doing anything. They're staying that wide on their own. Isn't that incredible? All right, now if I were to have used this one, that would have been too wide. But if you look, it will fit over this one now. Like I said, in the beginning of the video, when I took them out of the package, these suckers were way in here like this. Now look at them. Something that simple. Well, here you go all. I'm gonna put them on my head, show you what it looks like, give it a try, and we'll go from there. I'm actually thinking that's too wide. I'm a little scared, but I do have a big head, so. And I just put them on and they fit great. So there you have it. You'll never have to stretch and break them. 19 bucks. This thing is worth its weight in gold. Please like and subscribe to this channel because I got so many crazy ideas and things that I do to stuff that I'm going to start putting up and it'll save you money and I can take something that costs dollars and make it perform like something that costs hundreds of dollars. All right, here you have it. Here's the test. Here they are. Look at this. Wow. They slid over actually too easy, okay? So what I'm going to say is I may have spread these apart too much, believe it or not. But you know what? You can reheat them and bring them back in. But I wouldn't suggest doing that too many times. Okay? Maybe if I reheat them and hold them in a little bit um, and heat it up a little. But these things are sliding on my ears. That's how I want it to feel. I don't want it to feel like it's hurting my ears like they used to. All right, everybody. If this is what you like and you think this is awesome, subscribe to our channel because I got a lot more stuff coming like this. All right. Until then, have a great week and game on.